January 1996, short and English, senior first paper, get ready. Start. Mr. Vice Chairman, Sir, I rise to support the budget proposals at the outset. I would like to congratulate the Finance Minister on the effort he has made to get greater income with the least difficulty for the common man. Many points have been raised in the course of the debate and I would not like to repeat them. However, first of all, I would like to point out the higher allocation for the plan made in the budget. In spite of the scarcity of resources, I am very happy that the Finance Minister has raised the allocation to some extent. We are aware that the reduction of unemployment, the removal of poverty, etc. will depend on how well we are implementing our plans. It is clear that so far we have not had any signs of reduction in unemployment. However, but for our plans, we would not have made great progress. We may not be able to judge the progress of the country from statistics alone. Visits to various centers in different parts of the country and a closer look at the people will alone be able to make us understand the progress made. Now, we have been talking of inflation, but we must know that this inflation has also brought money to people who never had the money to spend. This does not mean that inflation is a blessing. On the contrary, inflation has affected the fixed income group very much. The redeeming part of the budget is that this year we have been able to keep the deficit at a lower level than feared. When the debate took place last year, at the time of the budget, it was feared that our deficit might be very high. The income has increased and in spite of this, there has been a deficit. But it is our good fortune that the impact of deficit on the price level this year has been very much less than last year. This is as a result of better agricultural production and its effect on the prices. However, as the finance minister has pointed out, there is the danger of further increase in the deficit this year for the reason that we have still to take into account the money due to the employees of the state as a result of rise in the cost of living. As far as the proposals of the finance minister are concerned, they have a minimum impact and that is a good sign. As far as possible, he has not levied any duties which will increase the prices in general. Now, as far as textile duty is concerned, I have no grudge that he has taxed the finer varieties of cloth. But at the same time, I would like to draw his kind attention to the fact that the smuggling that takes place is in this particular category. Then, as far as income from abroad by loans and other means is concerned, I request the Honourable Minister to take note of the Indians living abroad. There are a large number of Indians living abroad who would like to invest in India. At present, we invite loans from all sorts of the people and from all sorts of countries. But I do not understand why we should not invite our own countrymen abroad to invest their savings in our country. Many of them are interested in the welfare of our country. So, I request the Honourable Minister to consider this matter. With these words, I thank you for the opportunity that you have given me to speak on this occasion. Letter from the General Manager, Mrs. 
கோவிந்தன் அண்ட் கம்பெனி மெட்ராஸ் டு திரு கே ராமசுவாமி டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபோர் ஆர்மேனியன் சீட் மெட்ராஸ் டியர் சார் வி ஆர் தேங்க்ஃபுல் டு யூ ஃபார் யுவர் லெட்டர் ஆஃப் என்கொயரி வி ஆர் கிளாட் டு ஹியர் தட் யூ ஆர் இன்ட்ரெஸ்டட் இன் டெக்கரேட்டிங் யுவர் பங்கேலோ வி திங்க் தட் வி ஷேல் பி ஏபிள் டு மீட் யுவர் ரெக்குயர்மெண்ட்ஸ் சாட்டிஸ்ஃபேக்டரிலி வி என்க்ளோஸ் ஏ லிஸ்ட் ஆஃப் த ஆர்டிகிள்ஸ் தட் வி கேன் சப்ளை யூ and their price so far as furniture is concerned you have desired to know whether we shall be able to supply you visitors chairs and sofa sets we are in a position to meet your needs in this regard you may select the item that you require with reference to the list we shall make arrangements to supply you the items immediately we also supply wallpapers if you desire screens of an attractive type we will be able to fulfill your needs we shall be sending our representative to meet you in the afternoon of next wednesday so that you may have a free discussion with him he will inspect your bungalow and then he will be in a position to suggest the best way in which you can make use of the articles available with us you are always welcome to our showroom it will give you an idea of how you can decorate your bungalow and we will be able to help you in the matter yours faithfully stop